Hey everyone, this is Kelvin. Today I'm gonna review Barbie Birthday Wishes 2013 and 2014. The reason I make this review today because it's actually requested by one of my viewers, Krishna Chandra, and I promised to make this review just for her and also for others um, collectors who is curious about uh, which is the best birthday wishes dolls ever. As you will ask why I put these two dolls in the same box because I bought the Birthday Wishes 2013 as loose doll on eBay so she didn't come with her store stand or her original box. Luckily she's still in her original style so I still can able to make a review on her. If you wonder what her original box look like and should be look like this. I also bought the Birthday Wishes 2014 door um, as used condition on eBay so you will realize the box is actually not quite good um, it's got some shell wares but as long as the doors look like new so it's fine for me If you already watched a few of my Barbie doll reviews videos on here you will realize I really like to keep all my doors in the box um, to make sure they are free of dust and dirt so every time when I take them out from the box to make some videos, um, they still look like new. Okay, before we take them out from the box so we can have a better look on them, I would like to show you guys the Barbie birthday wishes in 20s. So in the earlier birthday wishes dolls, you will realize Mattel actually used the same face scrub to design all the lines. Um, except just different hair colors and different um, color of the gown they're wearing but in the birthday wishes line which the dolls wearing mermaid gown with different colors they actually make an african-american doll in the line however all the dolls in that line still got the same hairstyle and same gown but with different colors in 2013, um, that thing is time to improve the birthday wishes lines. So it's the first time they introduced uh, model Muse body on this door. All right, let's take these doors out from the box so we can have a better look on them. This is the back of the box for birthday wishes 2014. As I say, um, the box got some shell wares. Um, as long as I still can put my door back in. I'm not too concerned on the box conditions. Let's put our spotlight on Birthday Wishes 2013 first. Based on my first look on her, she already dominates my heart. She is wearing this lovely baby pink ball gown. The design and quantity of this gown are high standard. Her gown is actually got three layers, uh, which are the baby pink base dress, dotted lace as second layer, and the final layer is the lace decorated with ribbons. Also, her sleeves are made in lace, so her whole gown um, looks big and fluffy. She is actually look like a Disney princess for me. Let's have a closer look on her face. She actually got this young and sweet face with soft makeup that really complements her whole style. She is wearing this sweet pink bow headband with a pair of pearl earrings, all these are a plus for her style. She didn't come with any nails colors, so I painted her nails in pink to match with her style. Let's check out her hairstyle. So she got this long wavy hair, uh, which I washed and also styled with a hand cream. As I say, I bought her as loose store on eBay, so her hair was messy, so I have to wash and restyle her hair again. So her original hairstyle should be curly hair look like this. But I'm happy to see her in long wavy hair, which make her look cute and gorgeous with her whole style. However, one thing I found disappointing is the fact at the back of her gown, there's no ribbons decorate on it. This is a no for me. I don't know why Mattel decided not to add three more ribbons to decorate at the back of her gown. I know some collectors like to see their door in 360 degree views, just like me. So what do you think? 
She is wearing these color matching heels, which I think is a bit simple to match with her gown. So perhaps you should wear a pair of heels with a bow design on it. That will be a perfect match for her whole style. I did her pedicure with the same color of her nails, so she looks better while wearing these heels. Alright, let's have a final look on this store from head to toes. The gown she's wearing is really princess light and eye sketching. It's time to move our spotlight on birthday which is 2014. She is wearing this big and fluffy floral pink gown and complete with a white ribbon as a final touch on her gown. The design and quantity of this gown are also high standard and um, there are two layers on this gown. The white base dress as the first layer and the floral lace as the second layer. Her sleeves also made in lace. With her elegant curly hair, that enhances a sense of feminine on her whole style. Let's have a closer look on her face. She got this soft makeup and I really like her sweet smile which really make her look gorgeous and lovely for her whole style. She is wearing a pair of pearl earrings which is same as birthday which is 2013. She didn't come with any nails color so I painted her nails in paint to match with her style. Alright, let's check out her hairstyle. She got this beautiful and nicely done half pullback curly hair. As I mentioned before, her elegant curly hair with her floral gown really enhanced the scent of feminine for her whole style. And the back wheel of her gown just looked perfect with different layers. She is wearing this bright pink unique heels which I think is better than birthday which is 2013. I think these heels are uncommon to find, which you don't see often in other Barbie collections. Let's have a final look on the doll from head to toes. The design and details on this gown are just mesmerizing. She is just a beauty. Finally, it's time to score the doll. For birthday wishes 2013, I give her 9 out of 10. The fact she didn't have ribbons decorated at the back of her gown, she didn't come with any nails color, and she is wearing a pair of normal heels, all these make her lost one mark. For birthday wishes 2014, I will give her 9.5 out of 10. Besides, she didn't come with any nails color, I didn't find any dislike on her. So she deserves with this score. Overall, I think these two birthday wishes dolls are one of the best. Based on their gorgeous style and harmonious color matching, I think they are highly collectible and you must add in your collection if you haven't. Um, just try a lot to look for them online. Cause good quality Barbie like them will become less and less in the future. It's time for these gorgeous girls to start their double birthday party now. They're definitely showered by countless birthday gifts and wishes tonight. Alright, it's time to end my doll review for today. If you would like to watch more on my Barbie videos, um, there's a link below, so feel free to check them out. If you like this video, please like, share and subscribe. I see you all next time.